to my channel this is Isa Biad and you're watching on a silver budget today I'm going to show you what you can do with your wall um, all walls need to be addressed and properly done um, and today I will show you how to do it with a wall of windows a lot of us have that especially in the south we have a lot of windows in our houses so instead of um, finding a wall with I mean a full wall to put your artworks I try it with the window and what I've done is to put a little chain in there I attach it to the to the back of the frame and hook it up with the um, on top of the window so like that you still have your artwork done and you don't have to be worried about not having a wall why not we can do that just because you don't have a wall that can stop you from beautify your place okay let me show you another idea right after that all right guys this wall is right between two windows um, of course we have those little spaces that are really awkward and we don't want to put a big thing in there so instead of putting one big piece I just put three small mirrors there and um, it makes your eyes just go up and down and you can see everything in there instead of having a big piece or don't have anything at all and let's go to the next wall okay guys this is the third wall and again it's between two windows and since it's the holidays I was doing um, a cute design with gold copper and white my artwork is that a blue under this so I've decided to cover my artwork instead of putting it away and I was kind of worried about destroying my artwork because it's an original so I cover it up and I put a nice bow in there a cute little deer some ornaments and beautiful ribbons in there and it becomes a beautiful gift and you can put it in there and if you don't want that you can buy a lighter um, artwork or anything that you want that please you you can put in there make sure you address the the norm is to address your wall and this is it right there so let me show you a few more and we'll be done okay you guys I know you've seen this wall already on my home tour for 2018 but I really wanted to address this again um, this is a big sofa here and instead of putting one big artwork as I usually do um, for the holidays I de I've decided to use empty frames um, sheet music and small frames there and the four um, in between the frame this was all three of these were like big frames that I had I split them the black and then instead of having all of the things in here I empty everything and I got another frame and I put some music in there so anybody that comes in um, can sing along with those music shit, shit music I'm not gonna scare you off so I won't start singing um, and then this one I just roll the papers look at that and I've done all the little um, the deers with the papers and this you might wonder how do I do this it's while I'm cutting the deers I have those leftovers from the paper sheet um, the, the sheet music so I just fold them as black accordion and then I put them there and the flower I got it from Hobby Lobby and so um, and the ribbons as well and look at this it's really really nice and it's cost effective no money really the, the papers I think I got the book for a dollar something or two dollars from Goodwill 
and then I just stopped working and everything here I had them already so it's really good and it's large enough it covers the sofa back the back of the sofa so let's do two more and we'll be done okay you guys this is another idea for your very tall wall um, I've done three clocks in there because it's so tall I didn't want to put a long long artwork or nothing at all and leave it bare so by having the three clocks stuck up there um, it makes the wall look higher and it gives you an opportunity to see the wall see the tall wall because once you start with the first clock you will go all the way up and you see how tall is the wall and a tall wall is always beautiful and nice you don't have to put anything in there but it will be best if you can put something in there you don't have to put a lot but make sure you address that wall because it's a big large wall okay and let's go to the last one and we'll be done okay you guys this is the last wall that I'm showing you um, this will show you what you can do with your staircase you don't have to put a lot again but make sure you address the wall and this I've used a lot of plates a lot of vintage basic plates that I have um, and I stack them up you can put them as like around a circle um, area or you can do a straight you can design it the way you want because it's so many plates you can turn them around and play with them until you find the one that you like it's simple it's cheap and it's very cheap and it's beautiful so have fun and um, enjoy it okay you guys thank you so much for watching my channel thank you for watching on a silver budget i hope i gave you quite some ideas for your walls enjoy decorating your house it's the holidays have fun and i hope you have a merry christmas and a happy happy new year remember um, to do something good for somebody else and have fun with your house decorate and enjoy life is short guys take care and have fun thank you again for watching on a silver budget until next time bye bye kiss kiss